It is my absolute pleasure to present this series from Matt Thornton entitled Wokeness, Public Safety, BLM, and Antifa. Matt's been teaching functional martial arts for more than 30 years and holds a fifth degree black belt in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. His organization, Straight Blast Gym, has more than 70 locations worldwide and has produced champion MMA fighters as well as world-class self-defense and law enforcement instructors. Matt has a forthcoming book from Pitchstone Press entitled The Gift of Violence, Practical Knowledge for Surviving and Thriving in a Dangerous World. Matt's also one of my best friends. In this series, Matt speaks plainly and bluntly about physical violence. It's extraordinarily rare to hear someone so knowledgeable speak so clearly about such controversial and taboo topics. I'm confident you'll enjoy the series and truly learn from it. There are people walking around right now, there always have been, there always will be people walking around our planet who don't care about hurting other people. They would gladly hurt you or your children not think twice about it. We need to understand those people exist, they're there. The only thing that stops them is violence or the threat of violence. That's it. The reality is the only thing that's ever made the world more peaceful is the ability to engage in violence, to threaten violence, or to protect people from violence. My name's Matt Thornton. I'm the president and founder of SBG International. It's a worldwide organization. It's been around for 30 plus years, teaching functional martial arts, self-defense, and teaching the average person, everyday person, how to be safer. We have over 70 locations all over the world, and the clubs vary in different sizes. Uh, some of our instructors will focus more on makes martial arts, for example, SBG Ireland with Conor McGregor. Some of our instructors will focus more on functional self-defense, law enforcement, and uh, police training like Paul Sharp. I've been working on this book for about eight years, and what I did was I took the information that I've learned over the last three decades and tried to distill it down and offer it to people to help them become safer, help them have a better relationship to the topic. 